I don't know if you heard this, but the, the governor had said that anyone who disrespects him, quote, dog is pit. How does that come to you? If you doesn't this amount to some kind of disrespect to his political office? No, 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 I haven't. I haven't disrespected the governor in any way. I have not disrespected the governor in any way. What the governor made was a philosophical statement, and the pit will only be for those who who disrespect him. I cannot be seen to be dis, to be disrespecting the governor. If I say I am loyal to the minister of the FCT, no, that, that does not amount to disrespect for the governor. I am a lawyer. I know the position of the law. I am also a well brought up uh, uh, person, so I cannot disrespect any anybody in a, in a public office because even the Bible enjoins us to respect those in authority. But the Bible did not deny me my inalienable rights as to choice. Let me ask you this quickly. With what is going on in River State between Governor, uh, former Governor Wike and Governor Sim Fubara, what would you say is exactly the problem? What, what caused this field? Well, uh, Jean, I don't see a problem that exists here. What has happened is that some internally displaced politicians have taken the center stage and are beginning to uh, make commentaries uh, that have uh, exacerbated the system. That is what I see. But these politicians, who, who are these politicians? We are not there when we were working hard. Who are these politicians? Who are these to make the governor, governor. Who are these politicians? They are there. You see them, those who address the press conference in the, the former uh, in the office campaign office of the former uh, presidential candidate of the People's Democratic Party. Uh, they forgot to even do the decent thing of removing the banner that had the former uh, presidential candidate of the PDP in a room where they suddenly uh, declared support for President Bola Ahmed, Ahmed Shua, Ashiwaju, who they gave only two months in office to die. But today we are happy that we have improved right at the former governor, uh, President Bola Ahmed Tinibu, is as healthy as a, as a, as a, as a one-year-old. And we are seeing uh, uh, the dividends of his good governance.